External stowage platforms ESPs are key components of the International Space Station ISS. Each platform is made from steel and serves as an external pallet that can hold spare parts, also known as orbital replacement units ORIS, for the space station. As a platform it is not pressurized, but does require electricity to power the heaters of some of the stored equipment. ORIS are attached to the ESP via flight-releasable attachment mechanisms FRAMs, matching witness plates that mate the ORU to the platform. While minus one Spanish pesetas is unique in shape, minus two Spanish pesetas and minus three Spanish pesetas were based on the deployable version of the Integrated Cargo Carriers (ICC), which were designed to transport unpressurized cargo inside the Space Shuttle's cargo bay. Minus one Spanish pesetas was transported to the International Space Station on STS-102, minus two Spanish pesetas flew on mission STS-114 return to flight and minus three Spanish pesetas on mission STS-118. Topic. Locations and components Topic. Minus one Spanish pesetas The first of the external stowage platforms, called minus one Spanish pesetas, was installed on the port side trunnion pin on the outer hull of the Destiny Laboratory module on March 13, 2001 during the second EVA of the STS-102 Space Shuttle mission. It is powered by the Unity module and has two attach points to store ORIS. Minus one Spanish pesetas was carried into orbit on the underside of an integrated cargo carrier. It is smaller than the other ESPs and ELCs, with dimensions approximately 0.46 meters wide by 2.4 meters long, and is differently shaped. Minus one Spanish pesetas holds the following ORIS. FRAM-1 Pump Flow Control System PFCS, added by the STS-102 crew FRAM-2 Direct Current Switching Unit DCSU, added by STS-100 crew Topic. Minus 2 Spanish Pesetas Minus two Spanish pesetas was detached from its keel yoke assembly, which remained in the orbiter, and installed with the assistance of Space Shuttle Discovery's robotic arm and two spacewalkers during the STS-114 mission. It is much larger than minus one Spanish pesetas, with eight Fram sites creating room for up to eight spare parts. Oris. like minus one Spanish pesetas, it is powered by the Unity module. However, unlike minus one Spanish pesetas, minus two Spanish pesetas is attached to the Quest joint airlock using a specialized ESP attachment device ESPAD. Minus two Spanish pesetas and minus three Spanish pesetas are deployable versions of the integrated cargo carrier and have the same dimensions, approximately 8.5 feet 2.6 meters long and 14 feet 4.3 meters wide. The ORIS on minus two Spanish pesetas are FRAM-1 top side pump module SN0005. Moved here robotically from ELC-2 on 6 March 2015 in a swap with failed pump module SN0004, which had been relocated here by the ISS-41 US EVA-27 crew in October 2014. FRAM-2 top side direct current switching unit DCSU added by STS-123 crew FRAM formerly held the VSSA FRAM-3 top side CTC-3 container moved here via SPDM DCSU added by STS-123 crew had been relocated via SPDM January 30, 2013 to ELC-2 
Fram 4 top side latching end effector support equipment moved here via SPDM from ELC-1, main bus switching unit MBSU launched on minus two Spanish Pesetas moved to truss to replace a degraded unit which was brought inside and returned to Earth on SpaceX CRS-12. Fram 5 keel side pitch roll joint PRJ added by STS 123 crew Fram formerly held a CMG Fram 6 keel side main bus switching unit MBSU added by STS 120 crew this unit was swapped with a failed unit MBSU number no. 1 from the SO truss by the EXP 32 crew in late 2012 Fram 7 keel side flex hose rotary coupler FHRCSN1003 launched on minus 2 Spanish Pesetas Fram 8 keel side utility transfer assembly UTA launched on minus 2 Spanish Pesetas notes Video stanchion support assembly VSSA launched on minus 2 Spanish Pesetas at Fram 2 was jettisoned overboard on July 23, 2007. The video stanchions were placed on the truss during AVA's pump module PM SN0004 initially installed on Fram 1 during STS-121 was removed on August 17, 2010 by the EXP-24 crew and installed on S1 truss replacing the original failed PM SN0002 the failed unit had been temporarily stored on an ORU site on the MBS, then moved to minus two Spanish Pesetas by the STS-133 crew, then returned to Earth by the STS-135 crew July 13, 2011. A failed control moment gyroscope was installed on Fram 5 from August 13, 2007 during STS-118 until February 13, 2008 when it was returned by STS-122. MBSU was moved to the truss during Expedition 52 and the latching end effector was moved to two Spanish Pesetas to prepare for the spacewalk on January 23, 2018. The failed MBSU was returned to Earth on SpaceX CRS-12. Topic minus three Spanish Pesetas minus three Spanish Pesetas was detached from its keel yoke assembly, which remained in the orbiter, and installed on the P3 truss at UCCAS-1 on August 14, 2007, during the Space Shuttle STS-118 mission. It has seven attachment sites for ISS spare parts and assemblies, called Orbital Replacement Units ORIS. The platform also has handrails and attachment points for tethers and foot restraints that astronauts can use while working with the ORIS on the minus three Spanish Pesetas. Minus three Spanish Pesetas, as with minus two Spanish Pesetas are deployable versions of the integrated cargo carrier and have the same dimensions, approximately 8.5 feet long and 14 feet wide. Minus three Spanish Pesetas has two grapple fixtures to aid deployment. Minus three Spanish Pesetas was the first major station element to be installed completely by robotics, using only the shuttle and station's robotic arms, an external berthing camera system, BCS, and a photovoltaic radiator grapple fixture, PVRGF. Astronauts robotically installed the platform onto the station's P-3 truss segment during the STS-118 mission's seventh day. On January 12, 2010, the station's robotic arm was used again to move minus three Spanish Pesetas from the P-3 truss segment UCCAS-1 site. It was grappled by the arm and then transferred down the station's backbone on the mobile transporter. Minus three Spanish Pesetas was then attached to its new location on the lower part of S3 truss segment at the PA-3 site. Moving the storage platform cleared the way for Express Logistics Carrier 3 to be installed during STS-134. 
The Oris currently installed on minus three Spanish pesetas are Fram one top side pitch roll joint P R J launched on minus three Spanish pesetas Fram two top side flex hose rotary coupler F H R C S N one O O four added by S T S one hundred twenty six crew Fram three top side empty Fram four top side linear drive unit L D U added by S T S one hundred twenty seven Crew Fram 5 keel side space to ground antenna SGANT added by STS 127 Crew Fram 6 keel side battery charge discharge unit BCDU launched on minus three Spanish pesetas Fram 7 keel side auto flight support equipment FSE added by STS 118 Crew notes Fram 2 originally hosted NTA tank SN0005 that was launched on minus three Spanish pesetas, it was swapped for the depleted NTA SN0002 from the S-1 truss during STS-124. That failed unit was later returned on STS-126 when the FHRC was placed here. Fram 3 hosted pump module PM SN0006 that was added by the STS-127 crew. The ISS EXP-38 crew swapped PMSN-0006 with the failed PMSN-0004 from the S-1 truss during two AVAs December 21 and 24, 2013, leaving PMSN-0004 on the MBSORUPOA for later storage. It was eventually, in October 2014, stored on minus two Spanish pesetas Fram 1, rather than minus three Spanish pesetas Fram 3. Fram 4 hosted a CMG and frame and both were removed August 13, 2007 during STS-118. Support frame was placed on minus two Spanish pesetas, CMG was installed in the Z1. The failed CMG was placed on the CMG frame on minus two Spanish pesetas Fram 5 and later returned to Earth by STS-124. See also Integrated cargo carrier International Space Station Scientific research on the ISS Space Shuttle Orbital Replacement Unit Topic Notes Topic External Links NASA videos related to minus two Spanish pesetas Astrium North America, Inc.